this is my underwater photo shoot experience. So I had actually discovered Deep Grand Blue Studios a couple years ago. Um, I've been following them on Instagram and as you can see their work is amazing. Um, I've done a couple underwater photo shoots before but there were never anything that was like, you know, this level of amazing, this level of professional. So I planned it. Um, I was like, I have to shoot with them the next time I go to Korea. So I actually reached out to them on Kakao Chat, which is like Korean WhatsApp essentially. And I was like, can we do this dress, these type of photos? And I got everything scheduled actually. They were super helpful. As soon as you walk in, you can see they had a big screen with an amazing underwater model on it just to kind of provide like some inspiration, I guess. Um, and then as soon as I entered, actually, we got started with my hair and makeup and I believe it was like a special technique or formulation that works underwater. I don't think I ever see with red lipstick. I never wear lipstick, true. And after my makeup was all done, she got started on my hair and I just asked for a really simple updo and then came the part where we chose the crown. Um, she actually had a whole bunch of different selections and we just chose what we thought was the prettiest one. So I totally felt like a princess wearing a princess dress with a crown. It was just, everything was just so amazing from start to finish. And once I was all ready, it was time to actually hop in the water. So I chose to just do a shoot in their single person tank, but they actually had tanks that were much bigger than even this one. Um, the dress, as soon as I was getting in the water, was so heavy and it kept wanting to float upward. So it was definitely a little bit of a struggle there. So when I say this place is professional, I mean they are so professional. So there are these bars on the side that I was holding onto to keep myself above water when I wasn't ready to go under and a screen above me so the photographer could communicate. That's what he was pointing to. Yeah. So one of the things I'd like to add is that underwater shoots are so much harder than regular photo shoots because you're blind, okay. deaf, and you can't breathe. And here are the photos. Um, this was just us scrolling through the previews once the shoot was over and I was just ecstatic at how they came out. Um, about, I don't know, three days later they sent me all of the proofs so I could actually go through and choose my favorites for them to edit and send back. And here are the photos! They came out so, so good. I've been posting them everywhere. Absolutely in love with everything from this shoot.